My name is Gil Patterson, host of the Big 3 Me podcast, powered by G Media. But here today, I'm not here doing my podcast. I'm here at the Futures, uh, Futures Blockchain Crypto Conference here in Toronto, Canada with Rain. Now, Rain, you've had a career. You've had a musical career that has spanned... Uh, a couple of years. At least a couple <laughs> of years, because I do remember uh, listening to some songs when I was at the University of Maryland College Park, my roommate brought to me this this random group from Canada and then next thing you know we're replaying how many times have you been oh, ah! yeah. yeah you thought I didn't know uh, <laughs> yeah I might be a big American football player but I do know some music <laughs> so talk to me a little bit about how our lay of peace is now you know as part of your past and how NFT world is coming into the future for you guys at least for you yeah I mean so you know, I, I started back in the late 90s and anyone that started in, in music or entertainment back then has lived through a paradigm shift, right? From And for me, it was from selling physical goods to Apple made a song, 99 cents, so a digital file that you can now buy and then to, to streaming and these subscriptions. So it's changed the music business um, exponentially. And look, as an artist, like straight up, not for the better. We've had revenue streams like literally taken away from us. And so what Web3 kind of offers is this next paradigm shift where I'm really excited to live through another one to where we can claw back some of not only the revenue, but something that's always lacked for me was that connection directly with the fans. There's always, I always say there's, there's always these, these kind of middle layer platforms, companies, people that control our relationship with fans or our audience. And Web3 and the transparency and all the good things that it promises kind of removes that middle layer. And that's an incredible thing. To, and it's not just about, again, not trying to monetize my audience, but it's just having that direct connection. Now, you you brought up a very good point in which I actually like say, think of like, hey, you live through uh, LimeWire and Napster yeah. and people really stealing, legitimately stealing your work. Hmm. Now, reclaiming that work, reclaiming how your image is going to be seen in the future, is that is that also a big pull drive in? Like, hey, we can retake. Um, I guess let's put it this way. I had a conversation that it would have Basquiat family in perpetuity could have gotten money for the artwork that 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 he made. I mean, that's kind of what I, I, I equate you guys to. Right? Yeah, I mean, we talked the the ability for a smart contract to build in a royalty if someone were, were to buy something and then resell it later, and my kids could, you know get that royalty down the line that that's really exciting and that's that's really just one component so there's so many there's so many you know core principles that i see web3 really helping to create on every level now if you're a young person at home trying to get into uh, not only the music industry but the nft and crypto world what, what's going to be your your words of wisdom for them right now i mean it you know I'll be honest, it, it, it takes a minute and, and I hate that artists or creators have to be businessmen as well because that's not what we're born to do that using that right side of our brain but now you have to kind of like have the, the critical and creative side work together, understand what Web3 is, understand blockchain but if you make that investment now, especially as a new creator, it'll pay dividends off in the future. All right, well, Rain, thank you so much for joining us here. And everyone at home, make sure that you, how, Rain, how do they get, how do they find out what you're up to next? Yeah, I have a platform we just launched called Drops with two R's. Uh, it is all about community building and, and owning your audience. So it's drops with two R's.com. All right, everybody, thank you all again for joining us here today blockchain features conference here in Toronto, Canada. And as always, have a great day and an even better tomorrow.